Good afternoon, traders. It is Thursday, June 16, 2016, and the U.S. stock market is closed. Hey, we had an extension today of our horrible day yesterday. Um, it, as I predicted yesterday, it didn't get better. It got worse, and we had... Um, about negative nine thousand dollars in open trade yesterday on the close we ended up closing negative fifteen thousand dollars on that so very very bad not quite doubling our losses but coming pretty darn close uh, today is was just insanity you can see here what happened with the Dow, I called the Dow down for today. Sure looked like I was right at the beginning of the day. This thing just fell out of bed this morning. And when it gets down here, it's down about 150 points. Then it reverses and climbs all day long, gets back to break even, and keeps going further and ends up closing up 92. And, um, you know, we, we, we can't make money in reversing markets. Nobody can. I read about uh, hedge funds are just, are just a disaster zone, and they're um, making all kinds of uh, fee cuts in order to keep customers because they're not making money. Anyway, um, this is a horrible pattern. There's really no way to treat it. Uh, we didn't get into much today, but we are carrying negative $2,000 going into to tomorrow. So, you know, um, $15,000 closeout loss, carry negative 2000 more for tomorrow. Um, I would normally look at this pattern and say this is a bull spike very powerful rally and call the Dow up for tomorrow I'm going to be contrarian because um, I would have liked to have seen the Dow convincingly take out these highs from yesterday to really be convinced that it's going someplace but what's really got me um, against a further upside action is th the fact that the, the, I didn't see any buying going on. I mean, this is going up and up and up, but there wasn't anything happening with our portfolio. I mean, I got 50-some stocks in there and nothing's happening. So I think this is phony. I'm calling it down for tomorrow. Down for tomorrow on the Dow. Uh, I'll show you some of our frustration today this first trade is great this is j nug which is a gold bull and we bought this yesterday uh we we're holding nice profits on the close it gaps up it gaps up really big up here Unfortunately, we didn't have a crystal ball. Didn't get out right on the open. Well, look where we did get out. We got out there, and we made five thousand dollars positive in our gold bull. And you can see what happened the rest of the day. I mean, this was a very nice exit for that trade. No question about it. I mean, this thing actually went to a significant loss. By the end of the day had we hung on to it but we didn't so this trade looks spectacular and most of the days when we get a five thousand dollar winning day i'm mean a winning trade we should have a decent day right no today was a horrible day this this one great trade didn't even touch um our negative equity because it was so negative, and in spite of this, we went negative 15,000 in what we closed out. I'll show you 
one of the reasons, but there was a whole bunch of them. This is that CLRB Cell Collector Biosciences. Oh God, this is turning into a nightmare for us. We had this huge gap up yesterday and uh, bought it and then it closed against us. And I told you when I was looking at this thing on the close yesterday, it was like looking into the chasm of death or something like that. It didn't look good. And that's exactly what happened. It was just down, stopped us out uh, within the first 15 minutes of the day. And that, that honey took seven thousand dollars out of our portfolio seven thousand dollars negative that's tough and you can see why making five thousand dollars in jnug didn't help when we get a trade like this in our portfolio um i'll show you another frustration today this was this is a trade we are still holding. We got into this. This is LABD, which is our bioscience bear. So this thing's going to go up when the biosciences go down. Well, you saw the open. I showed you on the Dow. Everything was down at the beginning. So the bioscience bear goes up, gaps up keeps going and we looks like we almost bought the high up there and then is that market reverses the overall market reverses down 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 it goes and we're holding negative three thousand dollars in open trade equity in the bio bear terrible day not happy not happy at all this is trader bob signing off See you tomorrow on Friday.